Yo, what's going on guys? So today, I'm just going to be going over the leaks for Season 5. Credit to Archer Fortnite, I've watched his video. And Tabor Hill, credit to him as well, I've watched his video on it. So yeah, the first rumour is the streamers returning. So Nick Merckx, Tfue, Symphony and lots more streamers have been returning to Fortnite. So we know that this next event is probably going to be pretty big. If Fortnite has told them about it and they're returning because of that. So Tilted Towers could be coming to the map. The old map we could could see it i don't think we'll be put back on it but we could see it all right so the event is on a tuesday depending where you live and the event apparently replay mode won't be enabled until friday so people think that there's going to be a black hole event v2 so it would be so no one would be able to log on from tuesday wednesday thursday and then friday season 5 drops so if season 5 drops on friday then they would have heaps of people playing it because through the weekend, lots of people that don't really get to play during the week because of work or school, they'll be able to play. So that might be one of the reasons why they're dropping it on a Friday and the event on a Tuesday because more people are playing during the weekend. So less people on the servers so the event can run smoothly. Okay, so now the battle pass. I'll get the picture of the battle pass. So there is this leaked image of the Season 5 Battle Pass. It's got the Mandalorian skin and it's got two unique skins on the side. So this means no more hashtag ad battle passes. It means the game hopefully will go back to being good. And I think that the Mandalorian might be the secret skin like back like back when Deadpool was. And also if you look right next to the Mandalorian, there's a, there's a baby Yoda right there in that bowl. So that could be a backlink for the skin. Also Christmas skins would probably be in the battle pass as there's still the Ginger Renegade Raider leak. So that's still being leaked out. The Ginger Renegade Raider so that might be battle pass skin. Okay so if you guys remember from my Ginger Renegade video you would have seen this tweet up on your screen. So it says possible upcoming things for you know an anonymous source. So Ginger Renegade Raider in season 5 confirmed. So that means that the skin is confirmed. I don't know if it's going to be a battle pass skin or not. But I'm pretty sure it would probably be a battle pass skin. If they sell it in the item shop, they'd make lots of money. So they might do that. So exclusive PS5 skin. I'll throw that up right now. That's what it's supposed to look like. That's probably going to be the PS5 exclusive skin. Xbox S skin. So that's not confirmed. But that could be coming out. So Sharktooths. If you don't know who Sharktooths is. He is a... Sharktooths makes concept skins for Fortnite. And he's pretty good at them. You should probably know the box skins. They made it into the game. And he made those skins. So Fortnite's probably going to be adding some more of his concepts. And this last one. Giddy Up Fish Sticks. This is very unlikely. I don't think this one's coming to the game but if it does then you know i said it and also back to the pink goal and then purple skull i wasn't trying to clickbait about that video because they did not come out epic games has a switch in the files where they can just turn it on and give everyone the edit so i'm not just saying this i'm pretty sure hypex tweeted it out but i can't find the tweet but i remember it back when back when that didn't come out and yeah so yeah that's probably gonna be it thanks for watching this video if you did enjoy it, make sure you leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you are new. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Let's get into the rest of this. Now, there are two major theories, and what makes it even crazier is that they actually do make sense together, making it seem even more real. Plus, they will not tell me where they got this information, meaning either two things. They made it up themselves completely, and you'll see in a second, I don't think that's true, or it's real, and they can't share their source. But here we go. The first one, sit back and enjoy and wait until the next one. Now this starts off with leaked season five in the Mandalorian. A lot of you guys know about that already. And then it says event spoilers. Here we go. The event starts off with Galactus heading towards the west side of the island. He is huge, a lot bigger than Travis Scott. And we know this is a big update, so maybe they know this too, but either way, we know it's going to be huge and it's gonna be about 15 minutes long. Now the timer goes off and the big jet is moved towards the island. You hear Galactus evil laugh as he makes his way to the island. There is rifts everywhere. Tony Stark and Thor 
trigger these rifts in the sky. Galactus is attacked by loads of Quinjets, which a lot of leakers think these are going to be in the game now and is actually in the other leak. You guys will hear in just a second. Don't miss it. Outside the loop, this is noticed. We are then back to Agent John Jones' office. This time it pans out to see John Jones and characters there panicking, mentioning the loop. You guys remember that. It turns to the outside of the window where we see a city that looks like tilted towers where the Fortnite government are based. Now next up, it gets better. Galactus is getting hit hard and ends up falling, smashing the map in half. Then through each different rift, a rocket appears, and you'll see this again in the next leak, totally different, attempting to save the day. They all crash through rifts, all leading to one massive one where they form it and crash Galactus into it. Okay, if that makes sense. The seven disappear. We hear John Jones Jones, Joe Jones apparently mentioning it's finished we need to evacuate now we see the map burn up in flames Iron Man and Thor and the Avengers are nowhere to be seen Galactus heads away clear but before he goes all are pulled in from the island and pushed into the rift where we are sent into white remember this we see the butterfly and hear the og music i'm actually getting goosebumps right now i hope this is true we see a pov point of view of us in the battle bus heading over the old map blurred it then cuts to black to be continued in season five fortnite goes down for three days season five We'll have more Marvel. Galactus isn't finished yet. We're back to the old map and Galactus is on his way. It's the old map like we haven't seen before.